Hey, what's up? This is Chris on the longest way. Today is June 12th, 2018, and I'm staying inside here in Fede Dunkinar because I get a sunburn. <laughs> it's not the answer I was looking for. Um, remember how the first time I went into the Caspian Sea, when I went swimming, I was wearing all my clothes because everybody else was doing it? Turns out that was a good idea. Uh, yesterday I went swimming with just my shorts uh, because I saw some other dudes doing it. No women. You know, they either wear everything or they, they just don't go swimming. But I saw the other dudes in their swim trunks and their shorts and I thought, okay, so it's short time now. Yeah, it turns out I got a massive, massive sunburn on my chest. So, I'm inside. I got some, some of this stuff. And I hope that'll help. I don't know. <laughs> I don't even know if it's real. It's really hard to say, you know? Like, you go into some shop and then, what is Seagull Laboratory? Yeah, whatever. It's probably good. Looks like jelly. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, my, my motel room here is epic. It's huge. It's got a kitchen and more kitchen and a little fridge. And a TV that I don't watch, but I mean, look at it. It's huge. I got two rooms, two bedrooms. I don't use that one. Uh, instead, I, I went for the yellow room. It's sort of like I got my own Graceland going on here. Like Elvis has the green room and the other room, and I got the yellow room and the blue room. And uh, yeah, it's not even expensive. I bypassed a hotel on the way because, well, because it was too expensive. And then I asked here, it's a motel, so like people that park their cars right outside. Let's see if we can check it out here. Man, it's bright. Is that better? Anyway, like you can just park your car there and come right in. So that's good. You know, and I'm gonna wash some clothes tonight. These are my slippers from Turkmenistan. And uh, yeah, another thing I was going to show you guys. Let us see if I can get it back, get the camera back to where it was. Yeah, I got new stools. Two of them, and they're pink, and they're awesome. And I got them because the blue ones that I got in Uzbekistan after the accident. You know, remember I had an accident on... Uh, December 23rd, 2016 in Uzbekistan when, um, what was his name? Za something. A young dude, he ran into the caboose with his car and destroyed everything. And I needed new plastic stools to sit on. I like to get two so I can have guests. But they, yeah, I'm, I'm just too heavy, I guess. Or it's just, maybe it's a UV light, you know, makes them weak. So now I got new ones. And they're pink and they're awesome. You guys know I like pink. Which is why we're going to the pink laptop here. And I was going to show you what I do. What I'm busy with. I'm of course updating the blog. It takes a long time. Sometimes I wonder why I'm even doing it. <laughs> you know. Maybe I should just travel and that's it. Let me see if I can get the sharpness. Is it sharp? Yeah, sort of, huh? Yeah, so um, I got a PDF here. Let's see, make them bigger. From uh, my photo book which we published in 2012 with National Geographic and we're going to republish it. Uh, add another chapter, uh, switch the photos around, uh, make it look a little bit different, give it a different feel, make it stand out more from the uh, narrative book, from the travel book. So yeah, I gotta, I gotta check these photos and I gotta come up with uh, I don't know, with some text, some captions, stuff like that. Yeah, so that's, that's what I'm doing right now. And, um, yeah, it feels good. The, the owner of this motel is awesome. His name is Amir, young guy. And he gave me, not knowing that I don't like tea, uh, don't like coffee, but <laughs> he gave me coffee. Like my own private coffee thing. I mean, how can I not like it? Even if I don't really drink coffee, but... Mm. If somebody is so nice to you, you know, just shows up at your door, gives you coffee, then... No, that's good coffee then. And, yeah, sometimes I drink coffee, 
I used to drink uh, latte macchiatos when I first wrote The Longest Way, the book. Because I figured writers, they sit in cafes and they write. So I couldn't, I don't know, I couldn't drink tea in a cafe. I don't know why. It's, it's a cafe, so I should drink coffee. So uh, being the sissy that I am, I went for, uh, what was that? Latte macchiato. Cafe latte. Oh uh, yeah, but I'm not a big fan. And sometimes after dinner, I order, or after lunch, I order an espresso. And I always call it an espresso. X. Myself. And it's always nice to see the reactions. You know, they're like, oh, you want an espresso? And I'm like, yes, an espresso. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm a jerk. <laughs> I'm a jerk. <laughs> Alright, if you like the video, check out the blog. It's thelongestway.com. Um, or share the video. Share it with somebody who writes stuff. I don't care what kind of stuff. Could be books, could be, I don't know, uh, ads. Could be for school. Share it with somebody, show them. Tell them, that guy, he drinks cafe latte when he writes and he says espresso. I think he's a jerk. <laughs> Peace.